Okay, hello everyone and welcome back to GTA Vice City. So, I made it morning here, or day, finally completed this mission with the print works. It is time to move on. Hey, and I actually have my watch here, so I can look at the time. Yesterday's episode was a little bit short. Shorter than I normally do it. So, yeah, let's get going. Oh, this car. <laughs> this car. I think we're gonna finish up, like I said, the Cuba missions. I think, if I remember correctly, this one is pretty fun. Involves quite a bit of shooting. This is a great song, by the way. Like, 80s funk. Or disco or whatever. Always cool. Trojan voodoo. Hey, lady! You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna kill me a Haitian. And then, and then I'm gonna make love like a man. You know that, Chica? Something like this. Ah, 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 ah. Hey, baby! I wouldn't touch you with a ten-foot pole. Humberto Rovina, he likes a lady, not some goat in a skirt. Tommy, Tommy, I love you. I love you. Let's go. Go where? Can I get a cup of coffee first? No time for coffee. Besides, I just had one. We're going to take out the Haitians. Tommy, how do you take out a snake? You bite him in the ass. <laughs> Whatever you say, Umberto. Tommy, you go and get us a little Haitian car. When you get it, come back and pick up my boy, Pepe. And take them out to the Haitians. Then, you go around to the Haitians' processing plant. And you use their solvent as an explosive. Boom! Bye-bye! Umberto, what about you? Uh, I'm going to stay behind and watch over that cafe with Papa. She's not feeling so good, you know? <laughs> this guy. The last thing I needed was this. Maybe the last thing I needed was an enema, but this comes close. <laughs> I've never actually heard that. That is pretty funny. Is this guy coming with me? Oh. So yeah, obviously the instructions are pretty clear. We have to go and get a uh, Haitian voodoo. And the obvious, the, the obvious place to get it, and probably the easiest to get it, is next to... Yeah, it's wonderful. It's next to Auntie Poulet's house where we did the Haitian missions. You know, there's one always parked there. And hopefully, it is spawned right now. Because if not, we're gonna be in trouble. But yeah, it's normally there. I think like, it's there like 90% of the time. I just gotta remember where exactly that place is before I tip over this car because it is a piece of shit. Okay, there we go. That's all we needed. And, as you can see, we're close by to our destination. Yeah, this is more of like a shooting mission. I'm not that crazy. So yeah, we're going after them. Let's see, right into this alley. Gotta get into the alley. So this is a pretty fun mission. I like the kind of more unique concept. It's kind of more involved. But yeah, he's never gonna get his coffee, ever. That's just how it goes. So let's go and sneak in here. Of course, no one notices that we're not dressed like anyone else. Park the car at the blip and get out. Yeah, once we park... Yeah, we're gonna start shooting here. But things are pretty easy. Um, we have to take out a couple of people. If I can actually aim. Luckily, I have this incredibly powerful gun. And the gun they have is not very good. So, yeah, as you can see, there have been more difficult shooting missions than this. Oops, except when I get close. I thought this guy was dead. Okay, that's bomb number one. Oh, fuck. Oh, this is what I forgot. You're supposed to... Damn. I'm gonna have to be quick here. What I should have done is... Plant one... 
plan the one upstairs first and then take care of these. I think we should be good. Go, 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 go. Let's go this way. Say so you could use a car by the way. If you want it, but I think running out is easier. Plus I kind of screwed up and forgot that you can use the car. Oh well. We made it. And the power plant is destroyed. My car is still intact. So that's kind of cool. Yeah, pretty easy mission. For a, like, kind of like a final mission. Someone is still shooting something. Anyways, we're just gonna jump down. <laughs> yeah, so we're done with the Cuba missions. Pretty fun, except for that boat one. That boat one can get kind of difficult. Alright, we have to decide what to do next. We still do the print works. We have the airport mission to do with the phone. I think that's what I'm going to do next. Kind of screwed that one up because um, I didn't leave myself a getaway car. But things are going to change here. And also, the biker mission is... The second one is pretty annoying, the one that's coming up. Uh, yeah. But that's I'm going to have to do it because I need that to unlock the Lofus missions as well. I'm just going to get to this ammunition. Oops. Whatever. And of course, I can always buy more assets. But this is not what I really want. In fact... This is all I want. You know what? I think I'm gonna try... Sorry about that. I think I'm gonna try the second print work mission. Why not? I think that's... Besides this first one, the other two are... Kind of easy. And I wanna make actual progress here. Because that hasn't happened much in the past few episodes. This would be a pretty decent car for the airport thing. I mean, it's kind of fast, has good handling and everything. Hmm. But I still want to save first. Besides anything else. So, I think that should be the closest save point here. As of right now. Yeah, I'm actually driving decent. Haven't crashed into anything. Yeah, this car is actually... Pretty good. Damn. Let's see. We want to save right here. I said we want to save right here. Good. Yeah, let's do it. Airport mission. Of course, I showed it before, but... Yeah, that was my problem. I didn't leave myself a car to escape in. And that what, that's what ended up with me getting killed. Plus, I think I didn't have, like, full body armor. Oh shit, I definitely want to repair this thing before I get there. So I think we'll head... Oh, that might have been a bad idea. Yeah, I'm not gonna jump over because that's gonna end up with the car getting destroyed. Let's go this way, what's this way? I don't even know. There's also all sorts of secret places in the game. Okay, I kind of get where we are. Huh, where does this lead? Probably leads to a hidden package. Oh no, it doesn't. Thought that would lead up to the roof. But apparently not. I don't know, it's fun to explore. So I think we'll go... Sorry about that. There it is. That's the pay and spray I want. 
Hopefully my car is not gonna disappear, but honestly it shouldn't. Oh shit. Michael Jackson songs I'm almost always wary of because that's what I heard that uh, if you're gonna get a copyright strike on this game, it's the Michael Jackson song that's gonna get you. I guess they are on the lookout for that. But you know, you don't, you can't actually know. That's why I kind of keep the game volume low. Okay, I'm gonna try not trashing this thing. All right. Now, I'm just gonna hope that it stays here because, well, either last time I didn't get lucky with the spawns or your cars really do disappear. I'll park it right here, ready to get the hell out whenever I can. So yeah, we'll get rid of the weapons. Am airport is strangely empty. Oh, you can't skip these. That German accent, though. So yeah, by the way, this mission is pretty simple. I just completely forgot that people actually chase you. Walk down the escalators and ask them on the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We know. We know. All the way to the downtown ammunition. That's kind of a long distance, though. Oh, well. Hopefully I'll make it. Don't mind me. I'm just inside the airport with a sniper rifle. Don't mind me at all. So yeah, I think if you stand here, that should be fine. She just likes to take her sweet time. But it's this guy, by the way. Like I said, I, it's always the same guy. And just gotta wait. Maybe I'll just go like more this way. Meter doesn't actually go up, so it's not like if you're in view, it's gonna increase. So yeah, I'm gonna take care of. Oh, cause I had my fists. God damn it! No, don't pick it up. Don't pick that up. If you pick it up, you lose your other machine gun. So yeah, we got a wanted level. Hey there, police car. You just showed up quickly. Ah, god damn it, my car is gone. Sorry about that. I'm gonna borrow this. Just don't shoot the tires, please. God damn, how do you turn off? There we go. The police car is actually decent, so we should be just fine here. Fucking hell, they're really onto you, these guys. Shoot quickly as well. And cars are fucking impossible to control when the tires are burst. Especially these faster ones. I'm so dead. Get out, get out. Okay, I need to get something here. There's seriously nothing. Not a single car is spawning. Ah, god damn it. I'm so fucked. Maybe if we go here, they won't follow me. Of course they follow me. These guys, I think, this is one of those cars that... Yeah, this is a car that... Cannot be acquired by you. The only thing I'm hoping for is if I kill these assholes. God damn, I really need a ride. There's literally nothing here. And I have a three-star wanted level. Oh, they're now they're trying, trying to hit me. Yeah, as you can see, you can't... God damn, this mission is more difficult than I remember it to be. 
Okay, that doesn't. That's not gonna work. Yeah, I'm on foot because there's nothing else I can do. Oh, please be open. Please be open. Thank you. That's all I wanted. Go, and we should be fine. I think we're clear. I think we are in the clear. Fucking hell. I never remember that this thing was this difficult to control. Oh, now finally cars are spawning. I would like to get rid of my wanted star level. I don't think that's going to be happening. Anyways, we should be able to get to the ammunition. Except if I don't run into one of these spikes. Fucking hell. Really slidey card. Just because it's so damn fast. Alright, downtown ammunition, here we go. <laughs> that, that was... Didn't actually look that cool. I thought I would like burst through, but... Nah, didn't work. Oh, shit. Okay, now we're fucked. I'm nearly there. Talk about an action scene entrance. Hey, at least I can buy this straight away. Which I'm definitely gonna be needing. Nothing to see here. Oh, please tell me I can get one of these. Come on. No, I probably won't be able to. This fucking police car got out of the way. I might be able to shoot the doors off. Ah, I'd really want one of these. This is like one of those special cars. God, these idiots. Is he stuck there? Alright, come on, you asshole. I'm gonna help you out. So, let's see how we're gonna do this. We'll wait for him to get out. Wait for him to come right over here. Get in this thing. Oh, fuck, no! I did not just get busted, did I? God damn it. You know what? This shouldn't be too bad, honestly. Who cares? I have so much money, it doesn't even matter that they took my um they took my weapons. The only thing is that's kind of a shame is the ammo that I lost. But whatever, it's not gonna be the end of the world. I'm not gonna redo this mission just because But damn, I nearly had it. I could have gotten that black sentinel. There are these cars in the game that are unique, that actually cannot be gotten by you. And that car is one of those. Don't need a shotgun, really. You got this. I'll buy one of these. Do I want a sniper? I think I'll try getting the cheaper sniper rifle. Okay, where do we want to go next? We want to go save, because... Don't want to lose even more progress here. So I think I'm going to visit my little shack here. And... Damn, this... Bike. Holy shit. That's like a... Sorry, I almost hit you. But yeah, you can always get ammo here. Can't you? Apparently not. Maybe these two weapons don't use the same ammo. Whatever. Just go ahead and save and let's see how we're doing on time. Well, I'm nearly there. So I uh, go for a little bit more. No, I do want to save. And like I said, what I think I'm going to do is try the second one of these um, Printworks missions. Because that's pretty much all that is left besides the biker ones. And like I said, the second biker mission is kind of irritating. Basically, all you have to do is get like a huge wanted level onto you. I don't know, it just kind of gets difficult because it's on a time limit. And most of the time missions, timed missions in this game are kind of difficult. Oops. I wasn't even watching where I was going. Like an idiot. Uh-oh. Yeah, I understand you're pissed at me. No. Oh, shit. I thought I was going to fall off. Alright. Let's see what this is. I'm going to try and see what this is. If I can make it, 
I'll make it. If not, not. All right, the courier's moving the plate from the docks today. I'm gonna go intercept them, grab the plates, lose any heat, and make my way back here. Now, depending how well this goes, we may have five minutes to print the money before the counterfeit syndicate finds us, or we may have all year. Either way, I want green rolling off the presses five minutes after I get back. Got it? Don't you worry, Tommy. We'll be ready. Me and the boys will be around in the neighborhood in case you need any heat taken care of. All right, everybody cool? All right, I'll catch you later. Well, since I'm the mob boss, why do I need to take care of everything? Don't I have, like, people to do this for me? I don't know. Goddamn. Oh, well, that's convenient. That spawn, though. Did you see that? Holy shit. Alright, we're gonna be heading down there. This is not the best car to probably do this mission in. But what can you do? Gotta take what you can get. What I really didn't want is the bike, because that would end in disaster, probably. So, let's see, we have the helicopter. I think the yellow thing is the heli helicopter. Fuck, this thing is so slow. I'm gonna fall asleep by the time I get there. But yeah, we gotta go to the docks. Just like where we, pretty much where we were before. So I think there are gonna be some enemies in the way. Which means I'll probably stop here and... Get this. Alright. Yeah, there we go. Now, I don't know what exactly do we need to do. I don't know if I need to take care of these guys before or wait until the helicopter lands. Ah, fuck. There's one with the shotgun. Ah, God damn it. Alright, I'm dead. Or maybe not. Good. That's all I wanted. There's someone else with the shotgun. I can hear it. Which is... Gonna end up with me getting killed. Damn it. I should've been more careful. You know what? I should've bought a sniper rifle. Okay, that was real stupid of me. That was not the way to do this mission. Alright, I completely forgot that, yeah, the shotgun is probably the most um, deadly weapon in the game. You saw how quickly it took me out, mainly because it knocks you down. And enemies don't actually have like a grace period for you. So if they knock you down, you get back up and they can shoot you again and knock you down. So yeah, I think, what should I do next? Should I end this episode? I think that's what I'm going to do. We did two missions, two kind of difficult missions, but I think this was a lot of fun. Almost got that Black Sentinel, I'm still kind of pissed about that. But yeah, I want to thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this episode of GTA Vice City, and I'll see all of you next time. Goodbye.